Going for specific love. If you like movies, then you probably have a nice, awesome DVD or Blu-ray collection. We had hundreds and hundreds of these and they were just taking up too much space and we recently condensed it into one of these nice folders. But afterwards, we had hundreds, of course, of these old cases left over. And I got seven great ways to show you how to utilize some of these old cases. If you have any kids, you know when you travel, they love to take stuff, especially stuff like Legos. Well, here's a great idea. If you get your Lego baseboard, trim it to size, place it right over where the paper used to be, and now you can have a place that you can store your Legos, and it's a great little travel case. Now, in addition to this, you can take a clear version, do the same thing, put it all together, and now you can see inside of the case and you don't have to worry about opening it up and spilling stuff. If you ever have any need to stash a zip drive or maybe a, a good bit of cash, you can always stick it in an old DVD case and then you can stick it over in your movies. Or to be even safer, you can pull some of your movies out, stick it behind it, and nobody would be the wiser. Another great use is to take the DVD case and you can slide inside under the plastic some letters. That way you can do some initials maybe on a wall or maybe just over a desk or if you by chance happen to have some tile flooring or just some linoleum that looks like a tile flooring now you can play one huge game of Scrabble. Another great way to use this for your kids is if you open it up and you cut out the back ridges here in the place that actually holds the DVD then you get you some paper Cut it to size, slide it to one side, get you a pack of colored pencils that should fit right inside nicely, and now you have a little art travels kit. Have fun traveling. For this next idea, you're gonna need some of these small hinges. You then wanna lay the DVD cases face down, and you wanna make sure they are even across. Then attach the hinges, one at the top, one at the bottom. Make sure you attach it with at least two screws. And now you have an accordion type picture frame. You put all different kind of pictures you'd like in there. If you want to store it up, close it up. If you want to display it, open it up. Really nice. These DVD cases can make a great little mail holder, especially for like an office or a desk. If you get some 3M stickers, you can stick them on the back and it'll attach it to the wall or to the back of a desk, however you like. And that way, it can easily hold some letters. Now to do this is very simple. There's some tabs on the inside here that you do not want to cut off. You can cut right in the middle of it and that way it'll hold right there with just a big enough gap. You can slide some mail in. And if by chance you do want this bigger, just go in here and trim out the rest of the way. Angle it to about the width that you want. Tape it together and that way you can throw some larger quantities of mail inside. And we don't want to forget about the covers that come in the DVD cases because they make some awesome wall art for kids. 